to say to me? Here at BBC Berkshire, going to do a live session and interview, talk about Newbury. We're coming back here tomorrow uh, for the Newbury Festival, and then the next day I'll be doing a workshop for young musicians. So we are taking over Berkshire for the next three days. We are here in the Holden Newbury section of BBC Berkshire. It's lovely. Cavendish House, beautiful, um, and all of the uh, architecture and design is lovely to look at. So uh, just waiting to go in now and uh, we'll have a bit of warm up. So, it'd be so lucky. I wish I could do that, just pull out the sex and play wherever. So, <laughs> excited, just waiting on Phil now. Boris ambassador, you're a Prince Charles ambassador, you're even a doctor. <laughs> I am indeed, Dr. yes, yes. I think really all of that comes in aid of giving back. I think it's really important in enjoying the touring and enjoying the successes that we're having is to be able to give back to young musicians um, who uh, are 13 and, and younger and older that want to get into the industry and, and have an insight into, into what it means. Um, and for me, being able to do workshops as we're going to do here in Newbury on Saturday um, and be able to be a part of funds and awards for young musicians is really important. My 12 year old's doing the flute and she's part of the school Brilliant. orchestra and all that sort of stuff. So what is it? What, what, what advice do you give to those that are, you know, they enjoy their music, but perhaps they're never going to be a professional musician, sure. but what sort of advice do you give? I would say keep on, you know, I meet so many people now, I always meet people at the end of my concerts and sign CDs, and so many people say, I used to play the flute when I was at school, I used to play the cello, I wish I'd kept it up. And really, music shouldn't just be about, you know, passing grades, I know we have all of the, the grade system for, for young musicians, but it should be about enjoyment and being able to make music at whatever age, um, whenever you feel like it on a Saturday afternoon, got nothing else to do, let me get my flute out and just play a song. Or you can entertain others, you know, in the community. Music is really, really important and brings people together. So um, don't stop, keep enjoying it. <laughs> yeah. Okay, look, I, I play records every day, but um, and I can't believe I'm saying this, surrounded by musicians, <laughs> but I can't play an instrument. I've never played an instrument ever. Well, not even a piano. Must, we well, apart from that. That. Yes, yes, we must change that. But okay. also, yes. playing the uh, the CD player or the record player is as important because uh, yes. my dad was what really spurred me to understand music and different genres of music. And he can't play an instrument, but he plays a mean record player. Oh, okay. that's good. <laughs> dad dance as well. He does indeed. Oh, yeah. yeah, he's got some moves. He's got yes. some moves. <laughs> Today we are on our way to Newbury, but we have a new mode of transport which is looking pretty nice today. Things are looking good, it's a sunny day, which is another good sign. This is the second leg of our tour, so you know, we're hopeful, it should be a nice day. And Yolanda's not with us right now, she's making her own way there uh, with Child. We'll meet her there, kind of catch up and get things rolling. See you there. <laughs> Voice tell last time was was great. The last gig we it was a really special night. We even had a proposal. It was really cute. Um, yeah, and heartwarming. So um, I'm really excited about today. It's a beautiful day. It's going to be great.
amazed by the uh, quality of her play. I like the backing band, but the quality all around and the, the eclectic music, a bit of reggae and then a bit of jazz, a bit of improvisation, good 45 minutes of enjoyment listening to music. Absolutely fantastic, and I never intended to come and see it, so uh, brilliant surprise. Listen to her a little bit on YouTube today and thought that would be good, came to Newbury and said why not. So happily there were tickets available, it's fantastic. I'm thoroughly enjoying every minute of it, it's lovely. We saw Yolanda last year at Marlborough and we've seen her again for the second time, I'm really enjoying it. Yes, well, I'm very pleased, I thought it would be mainly jazz standards and I think it's really refreshing to hear something a bit different. We were just saying that um, Yolanda seems to make uh, the sax playing look absolutely effortless uh, and she's great. We like the band as well. Fantastic. Oh, it's great. The vibrance, oh, the energy of it is just fantastic. Oh, all the whole band's great. Yeah. They're all, you know, playing off each other. You know, the atmosphere is just beautiful. It brings the, the sound right down to a bare level. Mm. And you've just got the bare bones of the, of the notes there. She brings the image across. You can close your eyes and almost drift away with the music. And the guy on the keyboards clearly loves his, his reggae beat. It really is good with that. Those are the two highlights for me of the show. No, she brought you in, she's great, and it was just the atmosphere, and it was just really enjoyable, I have to say. Really enjoyed it, it was a fantastic show, brilliant performer. I thoroughly enjoyed it, it's the, it's the best concert I've seen since Barbara Thompson years and years ago, who sadly no longer plays, but uh, I thoroughly enjoyed this evening, well worthwhile. Inspirational. Um, I, I, I just wanted to dance. <laughs> I was right. dancing. Yeah, you're dancing in the sea. You wanted to yeah. get out in the island and throw some shapes. The one that was with it, Confusion, that one, that, that was really quite, it looked amazingly difficult to play. Um, I just think it's fantastic. Yeah. I've, I've been to see the Yolanda Brown in, and she was fabulous. She was absolutely fabulous. Um, and um, my husband just happened to be talking to a work colleague of his in Colorado this afternoon and said, you never guess, I'm going to watch a jazz concert tonight and it's Yolanda Brand and he is a keen musician and he said, you will love it, she's fabulous and she was and she wrote him a note Dear Craig, wish you were here, we missed you, love you Amanda. And he'll love that. <laughs> it was great. And 
I wish I could play like that. <laughs> and it was also lovely the way that everybody in the band seemed to be having a really good time, seemed to yeah. really enjoy what they did, and she included all of them all the time, and that was really nice as well. Yeah, because if you can get a British audience to respond, you're doing really well. <laughs> We, we're too reserved. We're far too reserved. Yeah. Oh, it was fantastic. Absolutely fantastic. Thoroughly enjoyed the evening. Uniqueness, versatility, sex. <laughs> <laughs> Just finished the gig here in Newbury. It has been fantastic. Second gig back, feeling good, vibes good. Thank you to everybody that came out. It was a part of the audience, it was fantastic. The tour continues, see you at the next gig. Just got off the plane, we are now in Jersey. ¿Alguien persona habla español aquí? ¿Sí? ¿Qué dicen? Dime otra vez. ¿Quieres salir conmigo mañana? Sí. Always say sí.